now's not really a good time. Okay? So when is? You may think talking's gonna fix anything. Robert, I'm sorry. Yeah, that's gonna be really good company to me, that, when I'm in prison. You're not going to prison. And you know that for sure, do you? Liv's been stupid, she knows that. Yeah, and as I've pointed out before, you knew too. But you didn't say anything to me. And what was I supposed to say? My messed up little sister just told me that she's reported you to the police for bribing that witness to make a false statement. After everything you've said about being honest with each other. I'm not gonna pretend this isn't a mess, but I'm stuck in the middle. Poor you. Come on, Robert. She's my little sister. I can't just give up on her. And you wouldn't either if it was you. You here for a bit of peace and quiet? What? Well, I'm guessing you're not here for the coffee. Mum always finds me jobs to do when I hang around. I don't want to know how to change a barrel. Yeah, guessing it must be getting pretty crowded over there. Yeah, it was. Was? But now Liv's gone. Gone? Aaron never said anything. Since when? Since yesterday. I saw her leave with a bag. Have you told anyone? Unbelievable. Look, all I know is she left yesterday and the bed won't slept in. You checked? And you didn't think to mention anything to anyone? Right, you've been a real help. Well, zero points for imagination, I'm afraid. I'm not going to say it's the first place I looked. Where's Aaron? Well, if you're bothered, why don't you call him? They're just too busy plotting new ways to ruin my life. Leave me alone. Well, it's tempting, believe me. Give it back. I should burn them all, to be honest. Why can't everyone just leave me alone? What did he say this time? Does it matter? Well, it shouldn't, but it clearly does. Bullies are good at that. Homing in on your insecurities. Truth is, they're the most insecure ones. Right, thanks for the chat. Well, I should know. I was a bully. You know, you could try looking a little more surprised. I did try and stop him, you know. Ryan. It was too late. Do you think you could go to prison for it? I don't know, maybe. But the truth is, I'll have had it coming. I guess you could call it karma. I've done my fair share of bad stuff over the years, believe me. I'm sorry. Yeah, me too. Come on. Let's get out of here. You don't tell me what to do. You know, you could try being a little less annoying. Right back at you. <laughs> well, I wasn't expecting this. Yeah. Don't worry, I was on my way out. No, no, no. I mean, Liv. She said that you two have had a chat. Yeah, I thought it was about time we sorted the differences out. And have you? Well, did you see any blood on the walls? It was a joke, by the way, just in case you didn't get it. Well, thank you. No, thank Liv. She was the one doing most of the apologising. Do you want to see another vibe? No, uh, I've got some stuff to sort out. Maybe give me a call later, yeah? All right. Oh, <laughs> watch it. I'm surprised they didn't smash. Must be a lucky day. Thanks. It was you. All this time, you're Liv's bully. <laughs>